guys, I'd like to show you Prismo 2.0. Um, I'll show it to you on my iPhone 4S, and um, it's a really great scanning app um, with great OCR accuracy and speed. And um, the new update is definitely worth getting, and it adds a bunch of a bunch of new features that are really cool. So here I'll show you the app. So I'm gonna press this um, button and make a new text document, and then I have options of how to get the image into Prismo. I can take a picture, use a photo album, or um, use the last picture taken. So I'm gonna take a picture. And then it brings me to the camera, and I'll just try to line it up, and it takes a picture. Then I'm going to press done, and it cropped it and did some adjustments to it to make it look better. Then I can go to that page and press recognize. And there it goes, it's scanning it. And now it found all the text within that image. And it's pretty accurate. You can see um, it thought some of the dark spots um, were um, images, but they were actually just hole punches. But you can um, change that by sliding over with your finger into this um, editor. And there you see all the zones that Prismo saw for the OCR. And you can change that to make the OCR more accurate or take away part of the, um, tell it not to use OCR on part of the document if you'd like. So then, when you're um, happy with all the text that it extracted, you can either translate or export. So once you're in the export menu, you have um, a bunch of options including um, read text aloud which uses um, a voice that you purchase using in-app purchases to read back the document and it reads it and the new feature is it also highlights as it goes along which is very very nice um, for people with learning disabilities you can also change the speed that it reads at. Um, also an expert, you can send by mail or open in a different app. This open in feature is really great because you can um, export the PDF with text um, directly to another app and use it just as if it was a PDF that you got on that you made on the computer. So for example, if you export it to um, iBooks, you'll be able to read it with voiceover just as you would any other PDF because um, it's already had OCR, OCR performed on it. The one, one thing I'd like to see them add in a future um, upgrade is a minor feature, but the ability to recognize multiple pages at once. It is possible when you've taken two pictures to have it do two at once, but it's kind of a um, odd workaround, and it's not um, as easy as I would like. It should be very simple just to recognize all the pages in a document um, to have it quickly OCR. Also built into Prismo um, is the ability to scan business cards and have them added directly to your contacts. Um, here is the main screen of Prismo and you have all the documents that you have um, scanned and you can add names to one them and um, sort them by name or date. One thing you can't do though is um, drag one on top of another to make a folder which will be a good feature. So Prismo is really great when you have a document that you um, don't have on the computer and you're not close to a scanner. You can just take a picture and it will be able to read it back to you in a couple of seconds.
Um, the read aloud screen is very nice, especially with the new highlighting. And I'll just show you some of the voices that you can um, buy. I have the Heather voice, but they have um, a whole bunch of voices in all different languages. This app also um, supports a large number of um, languages that it can do OCR on. So it's really cool, and then when I export it, it looks just like a PDF made on the computer. This has been Prismo 2.0 for iOS. Um, if you haven't already, it's a great update, and you can try it for yourself. Thanks for watching.